Hey guys, so today I have a haul for you. I haven't done a haul in a really, really long time. Um, I don't really go shopping a lot anymore, so I don't do a lot of hauls. But anyway, I have a haul for you. It's over about two or three trips. Um, yeah, like two or three different days. There is a lot of stuff, but every single thing in the bag is under $5. I think I'm the best bargain hunter around. I think that is amazing. I am a big bargain shopper. I hate spending full price on something because I know that in a few weeks it's going to go down in price anyway. So yeah, I hate buying something full price unless I absolutely love it. So yeah, all this stuff is under $5 like I just said. Um, and yeah, I got a big cotton bag full of stuff um, and I'm just going to get straight into it so that this video is not too long. Um, first off though, excuse my hair, it's still damp, I'm letting it dry naturally today because I like the way my hair looks when it dries naturally instead of blow drying it. So yeah, that's why it's a little bit scraggly at the moment. And also my nails, you will see these throughout the video, these look disgusting. I know, I need to shape them because I want to make them like those really nice round nails that everyone's rocking at the moment. I want to get like make them like those um, and I need to rip them. So excuse my nails, they're disgusting. Anyway, let's just get into the haul. So the first things I'll show you guys are just like products, like not, the rest of it is like clothing, but I have product as well. Well, not product, but like stuff. So I'll show you the stuff first. So the first things I have are from Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, oops, and these are just candles. Um, they have some really nice and cheap candles there. Cheap as in affordable. Um, so yeah, I have this one here. This one smells like driftwood. Well, not, it's the scent driftwood, but it doesn't really smell like driftwood. It smells like sea, like kind of like the ocean, but musk as well. It's really nice. I brought two of these, but one's burning now. And that was a dollar. And then I have this one here. It's just a nice round candle. I'm going to put it in my, um, I'm going to put it in my bird cage that I showed you guys in my August favourites. I'm going to put this in there and burn it so like all the pattern goes against my wall. But yeah, this is um, charcoal. Yeah, charcoal scented. Doesn't really smell like charcoal. I don't know what it smells like. It kind of smells like baking, but then it also smells like a mix of perfumes. So yeah, not those ones anyway. This one was like 240 or 230. And then the next things I have are these shoes. I'm just pulling out um, things while I nearly from the bag. I'm not really going in any particular order except from products or like stuff to clothes but yeah anyway um I got these from the warehouse and the warehouse has been having amazing sales lately I don't know if their light's too bright or not the warehouse has been having absolutely amazing sales lately so I got these these were only a dollar fifty um I brought two pairs of them but I've already worn, worn the second pair so I won't show them but yeah they're just really good plain flats I wear plain black flats to work so they wear out really really fast so yeah, they're good for $1.50. And these have actually lasted, um, fun fact, these have actually lasted longer than any of my, like, my cotton-on ones, my, just any other ones that I've really had. I've had two other pairs of black flats, and one was from cotton-on, and I can't quite remember where the other ones were from, but they have lasted nowhere near as long as these. These have lasted me a while, um, and they still look new, well, the ones that I've worn, of course, but yeah, those. Then I have some things from Uncle Bill's. I've done Uncle Bill's hauls before. I absolutely love Uncle Bill's. It's a big um, store that sells pretty much everything at really, really cheap prices. So yeah, I love that. Um, the first things I have, uh, these are kind of boring, so I'll show you these first. These are just six pairs of socks. Um, I needed new socks, so I just got these. And they've got like, they've got six pairs and they're really cool colours. So yeah, they were like $5.00. Next I have um, this candle here, it is from Candeo, um, I've never heard of that brand before and it's a tropical mango um, candle and it smells so 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 good. It smells like peaches and mangoes to me, it's really nice and it's just a long candle and I will enjoy burning. I've been obsessed with burning candles in my room lately so I'm just kind of stocking up on them. And that one was I believe like 2.30, something like that. Next I have this Radox Coconut Kisk Shower, Shower Cream. Um, this is like a new scent I think because it's got a big new thing on it. But this, I've used this once before and oh my god it is amazing. I love coconut scents throughout spring and summer. They are the best scents for them. I always use like coconut body lotion, coconut 
body wash, everything like that. I just love coconut in the summer and in spring. It was just, oh, it just reminded me of summer. I love it. But yeah, that was like $3, 3 or $4. Like, really, really cheap. Much cheaper than you'd buy it at the supermarket. And then the last thing from Uncle Bill's I have is this Max, what is it? Organic Mineral Compact Powder. I just saw this and I really, really like the packaging. Kind of, that's why I bought it really, because the packaging is really nice. Well, the box is really nice. Um, and it was only $4, so, and I love trying out new powders. So, yeah, I thought I'd get this. And this is what the container looks like. It's actually really good. I've tried it once so far. Once isn't really enough to tell you guys go and buy it or not, but um, for $4 you can't really go wrong. It's a really good colour. They have a really good colour selection and um, it matches your face really nicely. So yeah, if you want a new powder to go try out, like a cheap one, go to Uncle Bill's and get this. But That's what it looks like there. And I quite like that so far. Right, and the next things I have are from the warehouse. They are all bras. If you don't like seeing people's underwear, I haven't worn these before, by the way. If you don't like seeing, like, underwear in videos, then just skip forward. Um, but yeah, I'm going to show you guys anyway. These were an amazing price. Um, one of those, they're having, like, these dollar deals lately, and I heard over the microphone when I was in the warehouse that um, there was women's lingerie for a dollar, and you need to go get the guy to like price it at a dollar for you so I went there and I found three bras that I really liked well kind of like essential bras but yeah this one's just a plain black one you can't really have too much like plain bras because they're good for under t-shirts and stuff um, and this has a little bit of boost in it so. and then I also got this one this one's kind of weird I didn't notice this until I took it up to the counter but I'm not gonna put it down for a dollar this is one of those racer back ones and I don't have a racer back bra, I usually just wear normal bras with them, but this would be good to wear with my racer back um, tops so that you can't see the straps, so yeah, um, and it undoes at the front, like, I don't know how you do it, but it undoes, does it, it undoes, it undoes, it clips undone, like in the front, which is kind of weird, but yeah, again, can't go wrong for a dollar, and I needed a new white bra because my other one got like, I don't know, it got, when I put it in the wash it like went all funny, so I needed a new one. So yeah, and I like the lace pattern on this as well. It's pretty. And then my favourite one that I got, and I'm so stoked that I got this one for a dollar as well. This is, uh, this one here, it's so pretty. It's like, it's coming off a little bit more pink than it is, but it's like a ready pinky colour. Um, not as pink as it's coming off on camera though, and with this really nice black lace detailing, so... I love that one. I think that was the best buy that I bought that day. That one is from the brand, I'll tell you the brand, Rose and Thorn. The black one was just like the garage brand, um, the brand they sell at the warehouse. And then this one is the, what does it say? The design team. Oh. Wait, no, I think this is the underwear club. Yeah, this one, this one is from the brand The Underwear Club. And that's what I got from the warehouse. Now I'll move on to clothes that I got. Well, actually I have one more brush to show you, but that's from somewhere else, so we'll get into that soon. So next I have two tops. These are both from JJ's. I've worn them both already, which is why they're a little bit crinkled, because they've been in the wash, but oh my god, I nearly died when I saw these. These are Buffy the Vampire Slayer tops. Um... Buffy was my childhood. I absolutely loved that TV program. So I was so stoked when I saw these. And even better, they were only $5. So yeah, I got this one. It says Buffy and Xander and Willow and Rupert and Spike, which is like the main characters' names. Um, and I really, really like this. I love them. I just love Buffy. She's so cool. The program is so cool. I want to go get the series now. I haven't seen it in ages. But yeah, I got that one, which was $5. These are from JJ's, by the way. I think I said that. And then I got another one, and it's just a grey one that says don't be a slayer hater, with a picture of Buffy on it. And I really, really like that one. This was the first one that I saw, and I just fell in love with it. Don't be a slayer hater. I just, I love it. And then I have something from Cotton On. Um, majority of the stuff that I bought is from there. So first off, I just have this t-shirt. This is actually a boys t-shirt. But I really liked it, just as like a bed shirt. I'm um, just something to wear to 
bed because I like wearing like boys t-shirts to bed because they're really really comfortable um, and it's got picture it's got a real random picture on it it's got like a mirror effect of a girl what does it say on it temptation and then it's got a cross and then down the bottom it says too weird wait too weird to live too rare to die I think that's a really cool saying and yeah I really like the cross on it I don't know I just thought it was a really cool top so that's like my bed shirt top sort of thing and the rest of the things that I got from Cotton On are like actual girls things so yeah first off I'll show you another bra this is um, a really really pretty bra this was only five dollars they had like a whole wall of bras by the way I went to the Cotton On if you live in Wellington I went to the Cotton On out in Tawa and Dressmart um, so yeah that's why everything was so cheap because it's it's kind of like a clearance store um but yeah I got this one which was only five dollars and I just thought it was really pretty I love the I love this color it's like my favorite kind of purple um, and yeah it's really pretty I love the like, lace detailing and stuff and then I got some pajama shorts which were also only five dollars and yeah I have two pairs of these sort of ones already um, one's like a navy blue pair and then I have a white pair as well. Wow, my camera's gone really pink. Um, but yeah, I wanted the turquoise ones as well. So I got these and I love shorts, wearing shorts to bed. I don't like wearing long pants to bed because I get really uncomfortable. Like I just start moving around. So yeah, these are pretty. And then I just got a plain singlet. This is like a neon pink, um, just a plain singlet. This one was only $2 I think. Or was this five dollars as well? This might have been five dollars as well. It was either two dollars or five dollars, but yeah, it's just a plain neon singlet. And then the last thing I got from Cotton On is just this um, really, really large cardi. Um, it's a really big, long cardigan. It's just in that lilac purple again. It's really hard to show you guys. Like on, I'll probably put this in like an outfit of the day or something. I'm not gonna make a little extra part. Um, like to pop on the side I might just put it in an outfit of the day or something I might do like some lookbooks for spring but yeah it's just a kind of bat wing cardigan it's kind of hard to explain it's not long sleeved or anything it's just short sleeve but that'll be good for um, spring and summer just to pop over like a singlet or a short sleeve shirt I thought so yeah that one and that one was only five dollars too it has like a stripey effect I don't know if you're gonna be able to see the sun just came out so my camera is gonna go really bright I thought it was a pretty colour and just easy to pop over something. Wow, gone really, really bright now. And then the last thing I got, I went to Factory, which is also in um, Dress Mart and Tower. So I went and got a pair of shorts. They were only $5. Um, and they're just their Mustang shorts. They're just quite short shorts. I really like the colour. I don't have any shorts like this colour. So I thought this would be a new a good new addition to my short collection for this summer it's a little bit it's still a little bit too cold to wear shorts here but um while they're five dollars you may as well pick some up but yeah i really like the look of these and i like how they're frayed at the ends i don't like um just straight cut shorts i don't know why i just don't i prefer them to be like frayed but yeah that is all that i got for this haul i hope you guys enjoyed it if you have any questions leave them down below and yeah comment request subscribe and like and i'll see you all in my next video sorry about the lighting i've gone super bright bye bye